Hi there. I'm Timothy Linsdale, video producer and a Christian. Hey, uh, today, <clears throat> you know, I'm usually talking on multiple subjects, but today I want to talk about the Kiwanis and the value of that. talking about Kiwanis today. Uh, I usually talk about multiple different things, but this has proved to be a, a very interesting organization to me. Uh, I've been involved in the Boy Scouts a lot, <clears throat> but uh, I wanted to expand my experience so other things I could do um, with youth and uh, meet other people, you know, broaden my horizons as they say. And, and that's just what it's done. Uh, uh, the Kiwanis organ, uh, organization focuses on children, children of the world. That's, that's, that's what they focus on. It was originally started by businessmen, you know, in networking, and, but in the process of helping others. <clears throat> but it now focuses entirely on helping children. And um, I apparently may have enjoyed this too much because they made me president for a year. So traditionally, the different board positions are only held for a year. But the president position actually has three, three areas of being a, uh, uh, you know, the assistant president, if you will. Sorry, I'm kind of fumbling with that. What should I be saying here? The vice president? Uh, yes, sorry, vice president. <laughs> Can't even remember that. Anyway, we have a vice president. We have a uh, president-elect, and that person heads the program, which is usually getting speakers. And you're preparing to be president. Uh, <clears throat> And when you become president, of course, you're, you're, you're head of the board, you know, you run the meetings. Um, the clubs have uh, uh, committees that break everything down into committees. You have committee heads of different activities, uh, different goals, and it makes it manageable. Otherwise, you know, if it gets focused down too small, you can't do a lot and you burn yourself out. So one of the great things about clubs is you get a number of people together. And you can do a lot more when you get into a group. You can raise more money. You have more influence. You have, you know, you can contact more people. And, and that's the great part about these, these clubs. Now, the Kiwanis... Um, is uh, over a hundred years old. Um, started in the uh, U.S. It's now worldwide. Uh, Six hundred thousand volunteers that serve millions of people. That, that, isn't that neat? You know, six hundred thousand people serve millions. How, how important that is to come together. And how, how much you can do. It's terrific. Um, one of the things that, uh, well, several, I mean, we do multiple things in a year besides raising funds for kids. Uh, we'll have a, uh, a fishing derby where kids love to fish, uh, give out prizes. We do a thing where we stuff the bus. It's a big fun to raise. Well, actually what we do is we go to a store, ask them if we can, um, uh, you know, like an apartment store. Uh, uh, we're raising um, uh, school supplies. So people come in and, you know, you say, well, you know, can you help us? Well, we'll give you a list of uh, school supplies that are needed. We'll bring a school bus in and we try to fill that school bus. Which is pretty cool. And then uh, the uh, district that provided the school bus they take all those materials and uh, you know and disseminate them out to the to the kids and uh, kids you know that are 
maybe less fortunate and helps them out, helps the district out. This is one example. Uh, another one is we do collaborations. Um, actually, Kiwanis is a collaborative partner with, uh, with the Boy Scouts of America. Uh, they also uh, work with the Boys and Girls Club. Uh, we have a thing of feed the kids and family on, on Thanksgiving and we get together help them set up their room and uh, the tables settings break down all the turkeys you can believe we we have a, an arrangement with a with a uh, resort kitchen that that uh, roasts 45 turkeys and we get this group together and we break those turkeys down and uh, it, it's amazing how quick it happens. It's kind of fun. <laughs> we have several chefs that do the details for the cutting and prepping, but I had all the deboning and all that stuff the volunteers are doing. It's, uh, it's fun. It's just an example of the many things you can do. Uh, all kinds of fundraising opportunities. People want to help, you know, they really do. And uh, but you got to be out there. You got to be out there talking to people, showing them that you can do things. You can get things done. Uh, I mentioned that uh, Kiwanis is a, a worldwide organization. They got involved in a thing called the Eliminate Project, <clears throat> and um, in that it's it has to do with prenatal uh, tetanus. And thousands of kids and a large number of mothers die from this disease. And uh, we decided to focus on eliminating that disease. I don't know if you recall, but uh, at one time, uh, uh, when, uh, I'm, when smallpox was eradicated, uh, we made a concerted effort uh, to get to everybody around the world to vaccinate them from uh, from that disease, and it worked. Smallpox is pretty much gone, and this is what we're doing with with uh, that tetanus, and uh, by getting all all uh, mothers, uh, um, kids. Uh, you know, vaccinated, and it's happening. It's working. It's it's going to happen, and that that's an amazing thing to see because you've got all of, you get people together to help others, and you're getting stuff done. Um, something I wanted to read to you here. Take me a second to find it. <clears throat> It'll help you understand what Kiwanis is about, and they came up with these six permanent objects of Kiwanis in 1924. And here it goes. To give primacy to the human and spiritual rather than the material values of life. To encourage the daily living of the golden rule in all human relationships. To promote the adoption and the application of higher social, business, and professional standards. To develop by precept and example a more intelligent, and aggressive, and serviceable serviceable citizenship to provide through Kiwanis clubs a practical means to form enduring friendships to render altruistic service and to build better communities to cooperate in creating and maintaining the sound public opinion and high idealism which make possible the increase of righteousness justice patriotism and goodwill what more do you want <clears throat> Um, Boy Scouts of America have their oath and law, which is a big part of that program. And this gives you an example. I mean, it's running parallel to a lot of that. Uh, giving people opportunities to broaden their horizon, to help more people. Permanent objects give you an idea of how they, the club thinks. Um, what people what they're striving for is is helping others but but the joy of getting together with other people 
and helping kids. It's it's a lot of fun. You get more friends, you know, more opportunities for that. It's uh, it's a terrific thing to do, you know, and it's it's not hard, you know. Just show up and help, contribute where you can. It's a terrific way to go, and even if you aren't retired, it's a great opportunity for you to in, in your business or your work, but to give you that chance to help help kids, you know, it's uh, it's a great thing to do. So think about that. Join the Kiwanis. Thanks a lot. I'm Timothy Lindstyle. Have a great day.